What's up, Vloggy Pilots? Vloggy Poncho here. Today is January the 20th, 2024. I just uploaded the first episode of a new Minecraft series, so if you're not keeping up with the main channel, definitely go check that out. We also started XCOM 2 a few days ago. I'm going to kind of be going back and forth between those in my upload schedule. So today was, we were going to try and do a perfect day, and uh, I was just too cozy in bed this morning. I did not get up quick enough, so... We're going to at least miss that one, but I'll see how many of the others I can hit. We'll get you an update tomorrow. And uh, I think what we'll try to do is make tomorrow that perfect day instead. And again, just because it's not perfect doesn't mean it ain't worth doing. So we're going to keep trying to check the rest of these boxes off today. I'll give you an update on how it goes. Let's play the connections. I've been enjoying this one a lot lately. Although apparently people were really mad about the supposed clue characters category from the other day. All right, groups of four. <clears throat> I see carrot and I immediately think types of cake. Talk, tap, tear or tear. Drop, shower, fly, dip. Okay, so these are all words that mean go down. Carrot, salsa, sink, modern. Hmm. Blaze, swing, boom, race. I'm gonna cough. It has been so dry lately. My throat has been really, really drying out. Yeah, I think nothing else here means to go down. So let's just start with those, huh? Yeah. And that should be the easy one, right? Yeah. All right, so let's see what's left. Salsa and tap are both types of dance, as as is swing. Shower dancing, fly dancing, tear dancing, tear dancing, carrot dancing, perhaps modern dancing is a thing. Yeah, styles of dance, that seems pretty obvious. Now, what are the last two categories? And that's the, oh, that was meant to be the trickier one. Okay, so there should be a relatively straightforward green category sitting out here. Let's see. What in the world does carrot go with? Things that are orange, vegetables, things that you eat, things with a green top, things with vitamins. Mm, well, there's not, nothing's, nothing's popping out of me here. So let's see. Boom. It could be an increase, like an explosion of activity or an actual explosion. Fly could be an insect or the action. Hmm. I'm not seeing the other relatively obvious category here. Talk. Talk radio. Hmm. What the hell does carrot go with? Carrot top, carrot cake. Characters from Pajama Sam. <laughs> if it was like carrot, boat, um, mine cart, uh, tree, then, then I'd be in for characters from Pajama Sam. Could be words with homophones again. Tear, tear. Shower, shower. I don't see any others. This is not how you spell blase. It has an S. Hmm. be weather related terms shower boom blaze I don't really like that though it's pretty that's pretty wishy-washy okay maybe things words for hurrying Tearing, racing, blazing, and flying. 
right? Words for hurrying. He tore across the open field. He raced down the runway. You know, he flew up out of his seat. I guess blazing, like blazing saddles. It means fast, right? If that's the last, if that's the category, then what's the, what are the other four words? Carrot, shower, boom, talk. All right, let's try words that mean going fast. Indeed. Okay. What is this last category? Hmm. All right. Ah. Uh, words that come after baby. Baby shower, baby boom, baby carrots, baby talk. I knew the carrot was going to be the weird in the weird category. Cool. That was fun. And relatively quick. So I'd like to, if you tolerate it, solve the Monday crossword from this last week. We never did it. And these generally go really quick. So we just whoa, lounge about idly. That could be a lot of things. What Exxon and Shell sell? Oil. Outdated. It could be retro. Forcibly removed from power. Oust. Shoestring. Mm, give me a few things. Prefix with mural or mingle. In. Prefix with mingle. Bygone Russian emperor. That can be czar, but they changed up how they spell it depending on the puzzle. Arthur who won Wimbledon. Who knows? Football coach. Who knows? We have a clued puzzle. Inevitable, or a hint to these other three. Okay, so let's try and get some stuff that crosses with early with that so we can get the theme. Leave out, omit. Eye drop. Could be a wink. Potentially. Might, that might have a question mark at the end if it was wink. Free willy whale. Okay. It was an orca, I think. One of three bears in a fairy tale. It could be mama, papa, or baby. They all fit. Divisible by two is even. Barbers shout. What do barbers? Barbers don't yell? What the hell? <laughs> I don't know what that's supposed to be. White House daughter from 09 to 17. That's going to be one of the Obama kids. So we'll just fill that in. What were his kids' names? I want to say like like Malia or Malika or something like that. And then there was a, an older sister. I, I don't remember. Anyway, let's see. Inevitable. Born. Mm, maybe. Let's get more crosswords here. Little roll up in Tex-Mex cuisine. I believe that is a taquito. Okay. Render speechless mean a few things as yet okay so inevitable could be bound something like bound to happen yeah i wasn't really convinced with wink anyway so bound to happen i wonder what that hint means could be bound like step bound like you know like a, like a large step or bound like connected I think happen is bound to the end of the word. I guess we'll see. Let's go for the beginnings here. Disturb with a nudge. Hmm. Not at all whelmed. I don't know what the hell that's meant to mean. Let's jump back up to the top for the downs. Lock Scotland's Ness or Lomond. That would be a lock. L O C K lock. Inis flavored Greek liqueur. That's or orzo, or uzo. Is that how you spell it? I don't know. And make it snappy ASAP. We have loaf here. 1960s Western sitcom that takes place at Fort Courage. <laughs> Beats me. Start a subway ride. Hop, hop in a car. Hop, hop on the car. Hop on the train. I don't know. 
bound to happen. Train bound? Homeward bound? Hmm. It could be a few things. Let's keep moving. Large cut. Gash? So this could be gas, not oil. Post workout woe. That would be an ache. Be hot under the collar. Steam, steamy perhaps. Shoe string. Well, that could be a lace, shoe lace. Because shoe string can also mean cheap, as in a shoe string budget. Mexican American example, for example. It would be a Latin Mex. It could be Latino, Latinx, who knows. All right, so maybe this is hop on the train. Arthur, who won Wimbledon, who knows? Be hot under the collar is seethe. Red-cheeked Pokemon character. It's gotta be Pikachu. So I guess retro is incorrect. That's fine. Outdated, starting with a P. Mm, not sure. Year is in Latin. Uh, like on, Ani, I think, because Ano is the singular. Daring body double, like Debbie Evans in The Fast and the Furious. It'll be a stunt driver? No. Stunt actor, perhaps? However, informally, I don't know what they want for that. An ad hoc committee? Civil rights leader Rosa Parks. You should read up about her. But she wasn't the first person that happened to. She was kind of a test case that was deliberately engineered to draw attention to the inequality that was taking place. It doesn't mean it was any less real. It's just that, you know, they planned for her to be like a good example of somebody that they could take to court and say, look at this nice old lady and how bad everyone's treating her. And they were. Flickering glow of the northern lights. I don't know. Outdated. Pat. I have no idea. Intra, intramingle, inter, intermingle. All right, I don't know any, any names. Volleyball action between bump and spike. That would be a set. I guess it's a passe thing. Before in poetry is always E R E, air. Ere the sun had rose, ere the sun arisen, night in Paris. Oh, I don't know, noir? I think that just means black. Yes, to Yves. I don't know what the hell that means. All right, what do we got here? Wash oneself quickly. Hop in, hop in the shower. Jump in the shower. It needs to be four letters. Bound to happen. Okay, so I guess bound to jump is the theme we're going with here. So this one is seize an opportunity. Well, that's not really jump at the chance. Like he jumped at the chance of this. So you must do something else to get in the shower because there wouldn't be two clues that both use jump. Not at all wound. Yeah, I don't care about that. F. I don't know what the hell's going on there. I guess Night in Paris could be Noir or something close to it. Cover for Claudius. That would be a toga. So I guess it's Noit, which is probably just pronounced No. No. It's No. No. TGI Fridays. And then the I in that is It's, as in thanks. Thank God it's Friday. Concoct as a plan. It is hatched. Très stylish is uh, chic. I hate French words in crossword puzzles. I think they shouldn't be allowed. Chia Pet. Pain relief brand with an oxymoronic name. Oxymoronic meaning two, uh, two things that are juxtaposed that mean opposites, like jumbo shrimp. Um, icy hot. Opposites. Small dog's bark would be a yip. A-P-P -P up here is to seem. Unleash a tirade, you're ranting. Barber's shout. Next? Fucking rude, but I guess. Uh, one of three bears was Papa. Eve. I gotta love the singular for Eves. Prefix in aviation is arrow. An eye drop. Oh, a tear. A tear drop comes from the eye. An eye drop. Historical time span, era. Another very common word next to E-R-E. 
you have ERA, as yet, to date. Quid pro quo, so I guess, no, quid pro quo, yeah, quo, that's right. Render speechless is stun. Let's take the acrosses here. Me too, as am I. Put a cap on. I don't know what they want from that. Re remit, perhaps? Republic philosopher. That would be Plato, who wrote a, a piece of literature called Republic, often referred to now as Plato's Republic. Uh, the S of RSVP is, I think it's like CV Plu or something like that. I don't know how to spell French words. Once again, put a cap on would be limit. So... It's it's it stands for like please respond promptly or something like that to 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 like send, please send your answer something like that stunt woman okay bailed out of insurance company in bailed out insurance in two thousand eight that would be a ARG no I don't, who who what big bank was it I don't remember now citrus shade orange. It's an easy one. Let's get going. I'm in. Brave enough to come to the rescue. That would be... Uh, I was going to say heroic, but that doesn't really work. Oh, though, which would be... There we go. So I guess it's I'm on. No, come on. Come on. A-I-G. That's what it was. Oh, well, of course, the Northern Rights are an aurora. Warlike creature of Middle Earth, orc. I love when orc shows up. Orc, 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 orc. Disturb with a with a nudge. There's a J in it. It's gonna be interesting. Let's go for the across here. Old name in Tokyo. Edo, perhaps. Plot surprises are twists. This is probably yeah. SP is always either ASP or ESP. Um, fifty percent off store event. It's a sale, but it doesn't fit in with an A. I'm not at all whelmed. Uh, okay, so we've got I am Obama. I still don't remember the name. It'll it'll sound real familiar when we get to it again. Let's put the across in here. Turn on a dime. And then let's go here. Disturb with a nudge. I think it's gonna be jostle. So I guess it is jump in the shower. Perhaps we are going to leap at the, the uh, task, which means I think it was Malia Obama. Sale is ESP, and I just put the wrong letter in for some reason. Interesting. Not at all whelmed. Unawed. Yes would be who fucking knows. F troop? How do you spell we? It's O. It's O U. Yeah. O U I. Oi! Oi! That was a slow Monday, 12 minutes. That actually took quite a while. You don't normally have a theme in Monday puzzles, so that slowed me down a bit. Uh, and I had a lot of French words and names. That's. Eh, I'd give this puzzle a 4 out of 10. Not not impressed. Mondays should be easier and quicker than this, and generally a theme is not included. Okay, and now uh, an image. I miss Kansas. I miss the rains down in Africa. See you all tomorrow.